Hi. First, let's read the statement. Statement says, Nilesh is five years older than Bharat. Five years ago, Nilesh was twice as old as Bharat. Find their present ages. So we have one more age related problem and in this problem we are going to solve it using two methods. One is using one variable and in another method we are going to solve it using two variables. Right? So first we are going to solve it using one variable. So for that I'll make a table with their names. So we have two people. One is Nilesh. And another one is Bharat. Right? So, first we will assume their present age. So, at present, Nilesh is 5 years older than Bharat. So, since Bharat is younger, I am going to assume Bharat's age as X. Right? And since Nilesh is 5 years older than Bharat, Nilesh's age will be X plus 5. Right? The next part of the statement says, 5 years ago, Nilesh was twice as old as Bharat. So, first, let's calculate their ages 5 years ago. 5 years ago, Nilesh's age would have been x plus 5, which is his present age, minus 5, right, which is x. And Bharat's age would have been x minus 5, right. So, 5 years ago, Nilesh's age was x years and Bharat's age was x minus 5. Now, what the next part of the statement is saying. The next part of the statement is saying Nilesh was twice as old as Bharat. So, five years ago Nilesh's age was x and Bharat's age was x minus 5. Right? And what was the relation between them? The relation was Nilesh was twice as old as Bharat. That means Nilesh's age was two times Bharat's age. So, if we solve it further, we will get x equal to, let's distribute this 2 inside the bracket. So, we will get 2x minus 2 multiplied by 5 is 10. Right? And if we reposition this, we will get 2x minus x is equal to 10. That means x is equal to 10. And what is x? x is Bharat's age. So, at present, Bharat is 10 years old. Bharat is 10 years old. And what about Nilesh? And since Nilesh is 5 years older than Bharat, Nilesh's age will be x plus 5, which is x is 10 plus 5, 15 years. Right? So, we have found age of Bharat. Bharat is 10 years old. And we have also found Nilesh's age. Nilesh is 15 years old. Right? So, this was one method where we have used only one variable. In next method, we are going to use two variables. So, in the second method, let's assume Nilesh's age is x years and Bharat's age as y years. Right? And they are saying Nilesh is 5 years older than Bharat. That means x is equal to y plus 5 or you can say x minus y is equal to 5 
this we can call as equation number one right and now let's read the second part of the statement this part says five years ago Nilesh was twice as old as Bharat so five years ago Nilesh's age was x minus 5 right currently he is x years old so five years ago his age would have been x minus 5 and this is equal to 2 times Bharat's age 5 years ago. So what was Bharat's age 5 years ago? Yes, it would have been y minus 5. Why? Because current age of Bharat is y. Right? And now let's open this bracket. So we will get x minus 5 is equal to 2y minus 10. Right? Yes. So now let's reposition it and let's see what we get. So if we bring term with y on the left hand side and let's take this constant to the right hand side. So we will get x minus 2y is equal to minus 10 plus 5. That means x minus 2y is equal to minus 10 plus 5 is minus 5 and now let's call it as equation number 2 right yes so we have equation number 1 which is x minus y is equal to 5 then we have equation number 2 which is x minus 2y is equal to minus 5. So if we subtract equation 2 from equation 1 that is if we do equation 1 minus equation 2 we have to change the signs of second equation. So this plus x will become minus x minus 2y will become plus 2y and minus 5 will become plus 5 right and then this x and minus x will get cancelled and here we have 2y minus y which is y is equal to 5 plus 5 which is 10 right so we have got the value of y which is Bharat's age and this is 10 10 years and now we have to find Nilesh's age so Nilesh age from here it was x is equal to y plus 5 so x will be equal to y y is 10 plus 5 so the value of x we will get as 10 plus 5 15 years right yes so we have found the values of their ages they are actually the same as we found in our previous method so again it's completely up to you which method you want to practice or in which method you are more comfortable but I'll advise you to practice both the methods.